This is bullshit, Tyler. Why'd you take me here? Oh. Okay, this is right. Oh. I got one. Tyler. I think he dropped it. Harder, harder. That's pretty hard, man. That's giant. That's giant. <laughs> what is that shit? Why is he so fast? Did I like snag him or something? Tyler! Ty, how do you do this with your little chicken arms? Or it's giant. Oh, oh Tyler. I'm trying. Oh, he's. That's pretty big, man. I think it's a kitty. It is a kitty. Meat wagon. <laughs> Meat wagon, Tyler. Watch out. <laughs> that thing's huge, Tyler. It's a monster, buddy. That's the one you beat. I'm from Nebraska. I ain't used to this. Good morning, good morning, good. Is it still morning? I think it's still morning. We kind of woke up a little bit late, and we are actually down in the saltwater coastal thingy. Right? Right. Saltwater and stuff. But when we were walking up, we actually saw an alligator. Do they like the salt water, Tyler? They I don't, don't know. Care. They don't they're, care. They don't live there. They'll live in the salt or the fresh, but He huh? was like nine foot long. He was a big dude. Yeah. Well, I'm definitely not going to be going swimming, but uh, shout out to my buddy uh, Charlie's family for letting us stay here. We're staying at our uh, very own little beach house. Probably not going to take out the boat, but we are going to try to catch some fish here and then maybe do something else later and stuff and things. Puh. But are you going to eat them if you catch them? I might eat one. If we catch something worth eating, Just that's no legal. What we catch, we eat. Well, I'm not going to eat a grease ball catfish if you said they're worse than carp, but if we catch like a speckled spotted bay trout, then you're going to eat it? Maybe. Might eat those. We got live shrimp. I got some, uh, we have some frozen mullets. I have my own mullet. And uh, we're just going to be kind of warming up in here. I've uh, done saltwater fishing once. <laughs> Can't use your mullet, my mullet until you grow a mullet, Tyler. Might be waiting a while, but uh, yeah, I've only saltwater fished once in California and it was fun and we met good people, but the fish on average were pretty small. And in this little bay area here, the fish on average are probably pretty small. We got a better chance than we did in California, but then later today or tomorrow morning, we're going to go out to some big giant jetty and throw big giant things for maybe some big giant fish and hopefully I don't screw it up. But for now, we're going to do a little warm up session here, maybe cook some lunch, maybe do a catch and cook and uh, yeah, go from there. Get away, bird. Okay. And stuff. It's running on mine right now. Is it running on yours? Probably. Tyler's already caught a couple of little catfish things that are poisonous or something, right, Tyler? I think so. You think? They, they look like little camel cats, but it's a lot worse of a sting. A lot worse of a sting, and they taste like crap, apparently. Oh, Tyler, I got one. He's really poor. Can you move your foot? <laughs> All right, so what do I want here? Shrimp and then a mullet on one or something? I think a mullet, man. Okay. Well, I'll cut open the bag and we can start ripping these mullets. And one thing that I know about mullets is they're basically saltwater chads, right? Pretty much, super oily. And they don't eat lures and they eat moss, kind of like, like chads. Feeders. Yeah. Ooh, Sound. cut that guy out. Sounds chadly. Give me that head. Nope, you get the body or you can get your own head. That's my head. All right, so far so slow for me. Tyler's getting bites pretty regularly. I'm getting bites too, but I keep missing them, so. We just need to get on the saltwater board. I'm pretty sure the alligator bit my mullet and broke me off instantly, because something bit my piece of mullet and I reeled in nothing. What'd you lose? So I'm gonna downside do like a little crappie bobber, crappie jig head and a little piece of shrimp and see if I can't get wrecked over here. Or at least get a bite. Got something. I don't know what I got, but I got something finally. Wow. So I don't want to get spined by him. So I, I don't want to get spined by him. All right, Skippy. I'm gonna grab your tail. Eh. 
Yeah, he wasn't much, but he was something. I guess it's house cleaning day next door because it's loud. Um, we've got some bigger bites. We just haven't caught bigger fish. So we'll just keep trying. And like I said, we're going to be doing some other stuff later too. Some big jetty stuff. Did I say that? I forget what I even said, but we're doing this for now because we got our little private little area and we might as well, you know, test her out and stuff. A little scrappy or something. Hey, I got a flounder, Tyler. A freaking flounder. Oh, he came off. <laughs> I had a flounder. How big was it? I don't know, like. Cute little fella? Yeah. That's Isn't it though? How big do they have to keep? Be to keep? Yeah. Yeah, he definitely wasn't no 14, but I sure would have liked to touch him. Uh, no, not in person. I caught a halibut in California, which is similar, right? Yeah. Yeah. On a freaking Well, it's touching the bottom. Okay. Barely, it's just like skimming the bottom. It ain't real deep out there. I thought so. And a tiny jig head. I don't know. I've caught two fish pretty quick. Catfish. I'm on fire, Tyler. Why are saltwater fish so crafty? Tyler, I got something decent. I got something decent. I think it's a red, Tyler. I'm pretty sure I got a red fish. Oh, look, he's all blue. Tail. He's all blue. You got it? <laughs> Beautiful little red, man. Cool, man. Now we just need, a, like, his grandpa or something to eat one of our bigger baits, but... I, I think this, uh, the blue tail is because they are in the bay and they're, like, the more crabs and shrimp they eat... They turn blue? The bluer their tail gets. I've never caught a redfish before. Pretty good little battle, right? Yeah, he was scrapping. That's eight-pound ice line. Yeah. That's awesome, man. Not big enough, though. 20 to 20 to 28 or something yes, come here drum fish bud i love drum fish i think i got them figured out tyler Do you? it was in the water for no time but one split shot and a tiny hook figured out might be an overstatement but that sure worked pretty quick red bud we really want to catch a red fish to eat is the goal or a big giant fish off the jetty later but Right now the goal is to catch something to eat. He wouldn't quite 20 inches, and if he was 20 inches, I'm not sure if I would've got him in. Well, that was pretty neat on light line. Pounder or so, couple pounder. I found my little corner, I just gotta see what else swims through. And I think I got my rig. Switch between this and the bobber, but the jig head didn't seem to be working real all, all that well just because I cut out a lot of them, but I missed a lot of fish on the uh, jig head. This lighter, weightless -y option is probably a little better. Gives him a little bit better chance to take it. <clears throat> I don't know why this spot is better than over by our dock, but for some reason it is. I mean, we gotta be able to throw shrimp out into the lights and catch fish, huh? Yeah. Well, I don't wanna burn all our shrimp. But if nothing else, we got croaker we can throw out there too. Yeah, when the lights are on, we'll probably want big baits and lures. I got something. That's a, That's a fish and it's big. And I don't know if I'm gonna get it in. Did it stuck on something? Nope, that's all fish. Charlie, I'm trespassing. <clears throat> I got something big. Big. Yeah, yes, absolutely, I can't move it. I got a damn sea monster. No, it's not. Tyler, reel that one in. This is a big fish and I don't know if I'm gonna get it. You got one? No, I got a crab. He 
He's under the dock. Take your time. I don't know if there's I don't know if it matters what I do. I got eight pound test and it's like five pounds plus. Yes, I should have switched to 17. Does it feel really slow? Yes. Black drum. You think so? The way it's acting, that's what I think. It's big. That, that, that hook on there that's like... Tiny. It's big, though. Apparently. He's at the surface, luckily. He, oh! That was big. That was on shrimp? Little tiny piece of shrimp, big dog. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting this. We we're just catching little fish. That was giant. Did you see that thing? He was over, he was under that boat over there. I just got my ass kicked. It was slow and it was big. I don't know how big, but it was big. You think so? I thought it was like five at first, but it, when it got mad, it seemed a little bigger than that. Ball sacks, Tyler. I'm switching to 17. I'm not sure if that would help, to be honest. It definitely wouldn't hurt, but I don't think I would have caught that fish with 17 either. I literally would have gone swimming for you if it wasn't for that gator. I know. You know, I had that drop. Well, I thought about trying, I instantly knew I had to go on the neighbor's property. <laughs> I was like, there's no way. No, I'm sorry, neighbors. I am going to briefly trespass and I apologize. All right, well, 17 pound test it is and stuff. Tyler! Tyler! Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm from Nebraska, I ain't used to this. Hey, just fight him in, dude. Hey, if you don't want him, man, I'll take him, bro. Yeah, I don't want him. Yeah, I don't know what it is, but I assume it's a jack. Yeah. yeah. Get Sounds good, man. I'll take all the help I can get. I just got to get his ass in. Yeah, just when you get him up, just keep your uh, rod tip up. Okay, sounds good. Bro, your first cast? Over here, yep. <laughs> Let's see what the uh, $50 reel can do, Tyler. Smoked it. See how you hooked up and then everybody just... <laughs> yeah, that's all right. He's casting over me, though. Hey, how's it going, man? Good time. Hell yeah, man. I'm from Nebraska. I ain't used to this shit. You're over me, though. Yeah. I just drove from Nebraska. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, what size test line you got? I got 50 and then 50. Okay. So, 50 braid and then 50 mono. Tyler, this reel is a piece of shit. Yeah. <laughs> like, go this way? Okay. I'm open to suggestions, so keep throwing them out. First cast. <laughs> I'm not going to catch another fish the rest of the day. Tighten your drag a little bit. Just so you don't shoot the uh, rocks on you. Yeah, 
Yeah, come down over a little bit, stay in front of him. There you go. Stay on. Hey, anybody got some good shoes? Yeah. Oh, he got in the rocks. Oh, he broke off? Yeah. Oh. Did you break off? Yeah, he hit a rock. That was intense as though. That it hit a decent ways out. My knot held off, it just, it hit the mono. Man. How far out did it drive? I don't know. I mean, I didn't even start reeling, it hit it on the fall. I need a break after that. That was intense. Dang it, man. That hurt. My whole, I don't know, it was still fun. <laughs> Same pretty big? Oh, yeah. I mean, I hooked it, man. It dumped line for 30 seconds straight. Oh. All right. Well, as you can see, I'm back in Nebraska. Did I say that I was from Nebraska enough in this video? I think so. But seriously, I am from Nebraska. I ain't used to that shit. That was one of the craziest things that I've ever experienced. And even though I didn't catch the fish, like I said, it was uh, still a fun fight. But basically, I didn't explain it very well. We were staying at the beach house, and we did a little bit too much drinking. And after I caught the alligator gar, I was just kind of relaxing. Even though I didn't catch the alligator gar in this video, go watch the last video if you haven't seen it. It was pretty good. But uh, yeah, I think the Jack Creval, Crevalli, Trevally, definitely fought a hell of a lot harder than the alligator gar, and I wish I would have caught it. But yeah, basically, they only run through Texas like once a year or something, Tyler said. And basically walked up, first cast, hooked one when all those people were there trying to catch one. and got lucky and then I guess a little unlucky but this does conclude the saltwater portion of this trip we did fish saltwater two days in a row and we did fish at the beach house more but we never really hooked anything big we did catch some crabs ate some crabs and didn't record it but that was a good time and then I don't know caught a few other small fish but nothing to write home about but yeah if you like this video give this video a thumbs up leave a comment subscribe I'll definitely be going back to Texas and there's actually one more Texas video coming up and then, um, yeah, back to Nebraska things. Maybe another trip soon. Maybe to see somebody else. And, yeah. I don't know. I had a good time. But hopefully you enjoyed it. Thanks a lot for watching. Really appreciate it. See you later. Stuff and things. But poo poo, broken line. And more stuff and things. Bye bye. Yeah, I don't know, man. I mean, we can keep trying. Maybe luck will strike twice. Or strike twice. <laughs> <laughs> As I fall, <laughs> I was. <laughs>